Hi everybody, welcome. I hope you're all keeping well. Um, I can't believe this is week seven of lockdown. I kind of I imagined I'd be doing like two or three of these sessions and here we are seven weeks in and uh, it looks like there'll be a few more to come as well. But yeah, thanks for tuning in. Nice to have you all here and uh, I hope you're ready for a little bit of singing and some warming up and uh, yeah. The song today was chosen uh, yesterday when it was really nice and sunny. It's not quite so sunny today, but hopefully we can kind of tempt the sunshine out with a bit of singing. Um, so without any further ado, I think let's get started straight away and we're going to do some warming up. Um, so if you're up for a bit of moving around, let's have you up on your feet. If you're um, not so much up for that and uh, would rather stay seated, that's totally fine as well. The whole idea with these sessions is you can join in however you want, um, but I'm going to do a bit of a warm up and uh, you're very welcome to join in. Um, I'm just going to start with some shaky it out, hands, elbows, shoulders, a bit of the legs as well. Great, everything nice and loose. And then falling into a good singing position with your feet roughly shoulder width apart, knees nice and loose and then just roll your shoulders round nice and slowly. And then same thing going back the other way. Great, and then heads round slowly. Very nice, and back the other way as well. And then falling back into that good singing position with feet shoulder width apart, everything nice and loose, and knees bent slightly so you can bounce around. And then imagine a kind of um, invisible thread is sort of pulling you up through the top of your head so you're stood up nice and straight and taking a big breath through your nose and then breathe it out with a bit of a sigh <sighs> and another big breath in and then this time out with a Sunday evening groan <sighs> and last one big breath in and then this time out with a very high pitched sigh <sighs> Um, let's do a little bit of singing. So we're going to start with a hum. Can we just do a... Mm, with a little slide. And... Mm, ah, and... put that little slide in is so that we keep our heads in the same position uh, and anything that moves is the kind of mechanism that we need for singing in our throats. Um, we're just going to do a little lip trill or a kind of buzz sound, a if you can do that, or a rolled R if that's easier. And we're just going to slide around a little bit between low notes and high notes. So a and each time pushing your range a little bit further. Last one, and that's enough silly noises, I think. Um, welcome everybody, thank you so much for being here. Um, if you are tuning in for the first time, really nice to have you, and if you have sung on a Sunday evening before, then welcome back. Um, most people tuning in I know and sing with really regularly, um, which is lovely, and uh, yeah, I'm sorry that we can't be singing together as normal. Um, but uh, for those of you who I don't normally sing with, um, nice to have you here as well. And um, what's kind of amazing about these Sunday evening slots is that people have been tuning in from all over the place. I've had people tuning in from Taiwan, uh, quite a few people from the Netherlands. Um, yeah, diff lots of different places, which is great, as well as little pockets in London um, as well. Um, but yeah, wherever you are tuning in from, uh, a very warm welcome and I hope you're keeping well. Um, the idea with these sessions is just to have a bit of a sing really on uh, a Sunday evening and to keep the singing going while we're all stuck at home and not singing in the way that we normally would be. Um, and 
Uh, the song I've chosen for tonight is a song called Sun Giant by the Fleet Foxes. If you don't know Fleet Foxes, they're a kind of like uh, bearded modern day version of the Beach Boys, sort of. That wasn't a very good description of them. But they're a sort of new folk band, um, very beardy. And um, yeah, this song is probably about, probably about 10 years old now, but it's a really nice song um, from one of their EPs. And I chose it yesterday when it was really, really sunny, and I'm sorry it's not so sunny today, but I'm hoping that our singing will uh, inter intervene and, and sp speak directly to the weather gods so we get some sunshine tomorrow. And this song goes out to Simon and Susie because they requested it, um, but also to Jenny Bourne because I know it's one of her favourites as well. Um, and... Uh, the only thing you need to know, I think, if you haven't tuned in before, is that I put the lyrics in the description box under the video. Um, so, if, uh, And there are quite a few lyrics to this one, so it's worth looking them up. But in the video, you should find a link to uh, the lyrics for this one. And the other thing to say, actually, is if you want to um, chat to each other, there's a chat function down the side. And if you're signed into YouTube or logged into YouTube, then you can talk to each other and send each other messages as we go along. And then at the end of the session, I can read them all back as well. Um, and it is nice to know who's here. So if you are here, say hello um, if you're logged in. Um, great. I think that's enough introducing. Let's do some singing. So Sunshine is in, for the most part, three parts. Um, in the middle section it spits into four, or maybe more, actually more like six parts. Um, and for all of it, you can pick whichever part feels right. Um, I'm going to teach them kind of a, uh, quite specific pitches, but if you want to do one of the parts down the octave or up the octave, it kind of all works, so you're welcome to uh, sort of find your own way a little bit. Um, if you sing in a choir, then I'll, I'll sh and I will um, say which parts are alto, tenor, bass and stuff. If none of those things mean anything to you, just sing whichever part feels right. Um, but the first bit goes, in fact, maybe I'll just play you a little bit to get going. It's going to go a little bit like this. What a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead. carries on a bit like that. So you can hear it's three parts that move really, really together. Um, the rhythms all match up. It's only the melodies that are slightly different. And full disclosure, this piece has got a wide range. So all the parts have got uh, higher phrases and also some phrases right at the bottom of their range as well. I'm going to teach the uh, top part first, which is a kind of soprano alto -y part. So um, it goes like this. What a life I lead in the summer. Let's have a go after three. One, two, three. What a life I lead in the summer. Then we've got. What a life I lead in the spring. Two, three. What a life I lead. Spring. Then, what a life I lead when the wind it breathes. What a life I lead in the spring. I'll do that one more time because that's a long phrase. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. What a life I lead in the spring. So let's just go up to there. Um, I'm going to play the track with it. It goes one, two, three. What a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead in the spring. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. What a on with this part. Um, if you're interested in singing with the harmony parts, follow along because your phrases will match up exactly. But if I can get to the end of this part, um, it makes the whole thing easier when we put the other parts together. So the next phrase goes, um, What a life I lead when the 
sun breaks free. So same on the way up and way down. One, two, three. What a life I lead when the sun breaks free. As a giant torn from the clouds. Two, three. As a giant torn from the clouds. Then this next phrase you'll notice is almost exactly the same as the phrase that ended the first section. What a life indeed when that ancient seed is a buried, watered and ploughed. I'll do that one more time. What a life indeed when that ancient seed is a buried, watered and ploughed. So let's try and do the whole of that verse section and I'll do it a couple of times through because there's a lot in there. Um, what a one, two, three. What a life I lead in the summer. What a and there's a lot in there um, but uh, lots of phrases are really really similar so let's do it one more time and then I'll start building up some harmony parts underneath um, even if you're a harmony part sing along because your parts match up really really similarly in a second so here we go one more time from the top what one two three what a life I lead in the summer what a life I section. Um, I will play it again later and I'll keep playing it as I build some of the harmony parts underneath. Um, I'm going to play it one more time and this time I'm going to sing underneath the kind of bass part or bass low tenor part. Um, so if you just want to do that top part you'll get one more chance and basses and tenors tune into what I'm singing underneath. Uh, let me just check if I've got the right part selected. Yes I think so. Okay here it comes. One, two, three. What a life I lead in the summer, what a life I lead in the spring, what a life I lead when the wind it breathes, what a life I lead in the spring, what a a giant torn from the clouds. What a life indeed when that ancient sea is a buried water cloud. So 
let's break that down and do it in some detail. The shape of all those phrases is exactly the same. There's only um, a few inconsistencies in some of the intervals. So your part on it goes, on its own goes, what a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead in the spring. Two, three. What a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead in the spring. Then, quite high for a bass part this one. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. So you stay on one note for that last section. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. And then back down to what a life I lead in the spring. So those two phrases. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. What a life I lead in the spring. Then carrying on. What a life I lead when the sun breaks free. One, two, three. What a life I lead when the sun breaks free. As a giant torn from the clouds. And as a giant torn from the clouds. Those two phrases together. One, two, three. What a life I lead when the sun breaks free. As a giant torn from the clouds. Last phrase, really similar to the end of the first phrase. What a life indeed when that ancient seed is a buried, watered and ploughed. Together. What a life indeed when that ancient seed is a buried, watered and ploughed. So let's do the whole of that part all the way through and then we'll do it again but with the top part uh, added in. But for now just the bottom part. What a life. After three. One, two, three. What a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead in the spring. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. What a life I lead in the spring. What a life I lead when the sun breaks free. As a giant torn from the clouds. What a life indeed when that ancient seed is a buried, watered and ploughed. Great. Um, hopefully you got most of uh, the shapes in there. Let's do it one more time but this time with the tune on top. So top part and bottom part. What a life. What a life. It's the top part. One, two, three. What a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead in the spring. Is a 
buried water cloud. Great. There's now a third part to add, a middle part, um, which has exactly the same shape again. So this is kind of um, either a really high tenor part or an alto E type part. Um, mm -hmm, and it goes... In fact, maybe I'll just play it as I sing it. I'll, I'll play the whole thing through so you get a feel for it. What a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead in the spring. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. What a life I lead in the spring. What a As a giant torn from the skies, what a life indeed when that ancient seed is a very modern and plowed. Yeah, apart from me getting all the words wrong, that's how it goes. Um, so let's break that down into chunks. Phrase one. What a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead in the spring. Two, three. What a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead in the spring. Then, what a life I lead when the wind it breathes what a life i lead in the spring together and what a life i lead when the wind it breathes what a life i lead in the spring carrying on what a life i lead when the sun breaks free maybe let's just do that chunk on its own one two three what a life i lead when the sun breaks free as a giant torn from the clouds and as a giant torn from the clouds. Then same as the other two parts, the last phrase is really similar to what we had earlier. What a life indeed, when that ancient seed is a buried, watered and ploughed. Together. What a life indeed, when that ancient seed is a buried, watered and ploughed. Let's do the whole thing through and then I'll start adding in the harmony parts around it. What a life, two, three. What a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead in the spring. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. What a life I lead in the spring. What a life I lead when the sun breaks free as a giant torn from the clouds. What a Again, apart from my uh, word slip halfway through, I don't know why I keep tripping over, over that. Um, let's do the same thing again, but with the lower part as well. So the two bottom parts. So um, I think if you are regular choir members, um, kind of the bottom part is definitely for basses, but also maybe for some lower tenors. Um, and the middle part, the one I just did, is maybe for the higher tenors and definitely some altos as well. Um, okay, here we go. So bottom part and middle parts. What a life, what a life, one, 
one more time but with the tune on top this time so we'll have all three parts going so bottom part what a life middle part what a life top part what a life one two three what a life I lead in the summer what a life I of um, dynamics and shapes all of those phrases have a kind of arc to them starting low going high and coming back down again and I think the shape of it kind of follows that so when it's low it's a little bit softer and on those much higher phrases it's a bit fuller so the very first what a life I lead in the summer is kind of quite soft quite breathy on the voice when we get to what a life I lead. You can really open up and sing into those bigger phrases. Um, and similarly, the last one is the same. What a life indeed when that ain't. Those phrases are much, much bigger. But then it comes down again when it goes lower. What a life I lead when that ancient seed. Then soft for is a buried, watered and ploughed. So kind of uh, the shape the shape of all those phrases sort of implies uh, the phrasing we're going to give it as well. Um, let's do that same thing one more time, all three of those parts, because there's a lot of notes in there. So I'll play them all together. And this time I'm going to leave the track running into the middle section so you can hear what happens next. Um, you'll be glad to know the next section is really easy because <laughs> the first bit is quite tricky. Um, here we go. What a life for the bottom part. What a life middle part. What a life, top part. <clears throat> One, two, three. What a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead in the spring. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. What a
Um, so, nice and easy those middle sections. It starts in two parts, a kind of alto tenor part. Um, let me just find my music. We've got... Um, so altos, you've got two phrases. The first one goes... What a life! What a life! So really dead simple. Let's do it together. One, two, three. What a life! What a life! Then you do it again. What a life! What a life! And then you would do it two more times while the bass and sopranos come in either side. Um, alongside that alto part, tenors, you're gonna do... What a life! What a life! So again, two phrases and the second one drops down. Um, I'll do it one more time, twice through. I'm just gonna have a quick swig of water. I don't normally get hay fever, but this year it's really getting getting to me. What a life! Tennis. So one, two, three. What a life! What a life! Then again, what a life! What a life! And then you would do that two more times while the sopranos and basses come in around you. So basses, I'm going to give you two options. You can either opt for the really low or you can go somewhere in the middle. So the really low is what a life! What a life! So it jumps up at the end. So those two phrases together, I'm gonna to do it on microphone because it's so low I can barely sing it. <laughs> it goes, what a life, what a life, <clears throat> what a life. And then jumps up to, life, what a life. If that's too low, like it evidently is for me, mm -hmm, you can do, what a life, what a life, and then it repeats, what a life, what a life, um, and the first two uh, what a life's are just the altos and tenors on the second set is when the bass and sopranos join in. I haven't taught the soprano part yet. Yeah, I'll do the soprano part now. So sopranos. What a life! What a join in on the second two. Um, and really in this section basically it builds. So if you want to add your own harmonies either side of those feel free. If you want to go low or higher basically it just needs to fill out as it moves through. So it starts really soft in the voice and then when the basses and sopranos join in the whole thing uh, gets much richer, much fuller and much stronger. Um, I'm going to play from the beginning all the way up to there so you'll hear that section and you'll see what I mean about a building up. Just when we get to that middle section, remember that the altos and tenors start and then I'll wave um, when the sopranos and basses come in. So back to the top, we have got... 
Mm, what a life, what a life, what a life. One, two, three. What a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead in the spring. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. What a life I lead in the spring. What a As a giant torn from the clouds, what a life indeed when that ancient sea is a very modern cloud. Alto's tenor's really soft. What a that ending and then we've learned the whole thing um, the first two phrases are exactly the same uh, bear with me two seconds here we go um, so by exactly the same top part does what a life I lead in the summer what a life I lead in the spring same then here's where it changes a little bit what a life I I'll do that one more time. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. And for all parts, we really slow down for these last two phrases. And your last phrase, top part. What a life I lead in the spring. Which I think might be the same. Quick check. Da -da -da -da. Not quite, almost. What a life I lead in the spring. Two, three. What a life I lead in the spring. So let's just do those last two phrases where it's different. What a life. Two, three. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. Long gap. Two, Three. What a life I lead in the spring. And it can be really, really soft on the voice at the end. Um, great, should we just do that last chunk, just for the top part? What a life I lead in the summer. Two, three. What a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead in the spring. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. What a life I lead in the spring. 
So that's the top part for the last section. Uh, I'll do the bass part. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead in the spring. So that's the same. And here's where it changes. What a life I lead when the... Hold on. What a life I lead when the wind it breeds. I'll do that one more time because I was just reminding myself. What a life I lead when the wind it breeds. Together. One, two, three. What a life I lead when the wind it breeds. Then your last phrase. What a life I lead in the spring. And what a life I lead in the spring. So let's do the whole of that end section, just with the lowest part. What a life, two, three. What a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead in the spring. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. What a life I lead in the spring. Great. And last but not least, middle part. Um, again, your first two phrases are the same. Mm. What a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead in the spring. And here's where it changes. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. I'll do that one more time. What a life I lead when the Together, one, two, three. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. And your last phrase has a little jump in the middle. What a life I lead in the spring. I'll do it one more time. What a life I lead in the spring. Two, three. What a life I lead in the spring. So the whole of that last section, just the middle part. <laughs> what two, three. What a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead in the spring. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. What a life I lead in the spring. And that's all of the learning done for this song. So I'm going to suggest we sing the whole thing through from the beginning. Let me just put this down. Um, whole thing through from the beginning. Um, watch out, that ending will catch you up because it is a bit different to the first section. Um, let's have a go from the top. Uh, what was I going to say? Can't remember. Well, let's just sing all, <laughs> all the way through. What a life, low part. What a life, middle part. What a life, top part. One, two, three. What a life I lead in the summer What a life I lead in the spring What a life I lead when the wind it breathes What a life I lead in the spring What a life I lead when 
go. Well done, everybody. That's all there is to it. Um, let's sing it one more time, and I will not shout things out as we go through because it kind of ruins the magic a little bit. So one more time without me yelling over the top. Um, the only thing I would say is in that middle section, start small and then make sure it expands. And if you want to add your own harmonies, do. It just wants to get nice and rich there. So kind of feel your own way, really. Um, here we go. One more time from the top. What a life. Bottom part. What a life. Middle part. What a life. One, two, three. What a life I lead in the summer. What a life I lead in the spring. What a life I lead when the wind it breathes. What a everybody i hope you've enjoyed learning a bit of sun giant um i recommend listening to the original because it's great it's a really really good recording um you can find it on spotify youtube anywhere fleet foxes are the name of the band and um yeah it's the reason i've drenched this version in reverb is because they kind of do the same but with a really like vintagey uh nice uh, it just sounds great it sounds really really nice so go and have a listen to the original um, I'd like to sing it one more time with you all because um, we spent a nice bit of time learning it so it'd be nice and rewarding to do it one more time but before we do I'll just do a couple of quick uh, kind of like announcement type things first of all a massive massive thank you to um, everybody who submitted a video for my virtual choir project um, I had over a hundred videos which is amazing and kind of slightly overwhelming and terrifying I'm worried that my computer is gonna crash when I try and put them all together but yeah thanks very much to everybody who has sent in a video um, it's gonna sound great and look great as well um, if you still want to send in a video my absolute cutoff is tonight so if you want to send one in uh, before tomorrow uh, feel free but I'm gonna start working on it tomorrow so really the deadline is end of today um, yeah, sorry to be a bit cutthroat about it, but I've, uh, yeah, I don't want to, <laughs> I don't want to dig myself too deep. So end of today is the deadline. Uh, but yeah, thanks to everybody who's contributed. Um, and on that note, it looks like you know lockdown is going to carry on for a fair few more weeks, um, which obviously makes singing difficult. Um, so if anybody has got any ideas about other projects that I could um, instigate, then let me know. Because, uh, yeah, you know, I want to keep everybody singing and that's kind of what I do day to day. So, uh, yeah, definitely on the lookout for new projects and new ideas. I've got a couple of ideas at the back of my mind, which I'm going to try and make happen. Um, and we'll share details of those as and when they become a thing. Um, 
but if you've got things that you feel like you want to do or things you want to get involved with then do let me know because you know I'm here to here to help and here to uh, do as much singing as possible um, I think that's it I don't think I've got anything else to say other than this happens every Sunday evening so I'll be back next week with another song um, I've got a few arrangements in the pipeline um, for the for the weeks ahead including at some point an arrangement of Don't Worry Be Happy by Bobby McFerrin which is going to be really fun and quite a few of you have asked for that one um, yeah if you've got suggestions send them my way um, yeah I think that's it shall we sing it one more time because it sounds nice here we go um, from the top last time through and add lib your own harmonies this time one two three what a life I lead in the summer what a life I lead in the spring what a life I lead when the wind it breathes what a What a life I lead when the sun breaks free as a child torn from the clouds. What a life indeed when that ancient sea is a so much for everybody thank you for singing along I really enjoy doing these Sunday night sessions um, so thank you for being here with me and singing along I hope you've enjoyed it um, I'm gonna come and read some of your comments but uh, my parting message is just take care stay well keep singing and um, yeah I look forward to seeing you all next time bye bye thank you Thanks everyone, bye.